you enjoyed the one-day warm-up, it was a nice reminder of what spring could and eventually will be. Thing was, it's not lasting this go-around. Tomorrow morning, there's your hint that it's changing. We'll be in the upper 20s. The sun will be out. That'll help. As we get you into the middle of the day, we're just in the low 40s. The clouds are increasing at that point. Should be mainly cloudy by the latter part of the day. And temperatures, instead of the 60s of today, let's settle back into the 40s. So how do we get there? First of all, Max Track Live Doppler is nothing going on. Can, it's, I mean, it's not a surprise because it's, it's going with the forecast, but normally when you have a cold front dropping through, especially one that's got a little oomph to it, you'd see some rain, but no, not with this one. It is coming through dry. So tonight, it's the dry cold front for St. Patrick's Day. There's going to be a 25, maybe a 30 degree swing across the state with a front cutting basically across the middle. 20, 30 miles is going to make all the difference if it's a spring feel or kind of the yickiness of February. Well, what well, February normally would be, not what we had this February. And in the eight day, we just mock the change of seasons that are coming. Uh, we are talking about temperatures that would be rising toward the upper 50s by the middle of next week. Oh, that would sound nice. Now today, we made the low 60s, but there's your cool off for tomorrow. A little bit of a moderation. Saturday still maybe on the optimistic side for Lexington. And then we get low 60s again before the next shot of cold air comes in for the beginning of spring on Tuesday. 49 Bluegrass Airport, north wind at 9. Your wind chill is essentially negligible. 62, 31, a 31 degree swing in temperatures today. Considering there was not a front that came by, that's a pretty big deal. We are still fairly mild southern Kentucky. I mean, look at low and mid 50s. 55 in Monticello, 54 in Williamsburg, London's at 49. But it's 46 in Frankfurt, 44 in Flemingsburg, so the cooler air is trying to come south. So there's your front here at midnight at about I-64, north winds behind it. As we were watching this area of low pressure develop out here to the west, it is going to yank up a big chunk of warm air. The thing is, that low is weakening. If it were strengthening, it would be able to yank the front north far enough and overpower that high. Looks like the high is going to win the battle, at least for a lot of us. By Friday late, we are in the cooler air. That's why our temperatures tomorrow will be in the 40s instead of the 60s. Now the front tries to bubble north a little. There's midnight, Friday night into Saturday. Look at early Saturday morning. There could be, there might be, it's a possibility that there could be a little wintry mix at the very onset of this late Friday night, early Saturday morning. It will turn into a cold rain as we continue through the day. And the thing is, the front's going to be bisecting the area as the uh, wave of low pressure eventually slides off to these. But you notice the rain is going to hang around for a good chunk of the day. So we're, this is a quasi-stationary front. We're looking here at Saturday. What's going to happen is it's going to try and bubble north for a while during the morning hours on Saturday. You see the 50s and even 60s growing to the south. But you notice it never really gets to I-64. Now, if it's able to get up here, then all of a sudden St. Patrick's Day, all the stuff going on in Lexington ends up being a much warmer day as it is. I think it's going to remain just south, but look at how, how perilously close the warmth is. It will be in the neighborhood, but I don't think it'll get quite this far. But there's always the hope the luck of the Irish comes into play. Clear to partly cloudy down to the upper 20s tonight, then it's upper 40s tomorrow. Clouds will be increasing during the afternoon. Saturday, we've got the clouds and the rain. We're forecasting low 50s in Lexington likely it'll be right about that ballpark. Oh yeah, and it may snow oh, Tuesday night and gosh. Wednesday as we start spring. Just can't seem to get away from it quite yet. Snow does not want to give up. Uh, we're close, we're close. Thanks.